Love yours. No such thing. No such thing as a life that's better than yours. No such thing as a life that's better than yours. Love yours. Know that he alive Fake niggas, mad snakes, snakes in the grass Let a nigga know that he arrived Don't be sleeping on your level Cause it's beauty in the struggle, nigga It's beauty in the struggle, nigga Beauty in the struggle, ugliness in the success Hear my words and listen to my signal of distress I grew up in the city and know sometimes we had less Compared to some of my niggas down the block, man, we were blessed Hey friends, welcome or welcome back to another video I know y'all like, hey, what the fuck is going on, girl? Why is the video starting like this? So, let me just tell y'all how I was a dumbass and deleted the whole first clip of this video so basically to just catch y'all up i wasn't really talking about much in the beginning of the video honestly i don't even remember what i was talking about but in this next scene that y'all are about to see um yeah sonic i'm getting breakfast for joseph and i just ended up getting uh orange juice so yeah that's all that's tea let's just go ahead and get into the video hi let me get three orders of the french toast Got it. Let me actually do two of the combo and one by itself. Got it. Orange juice. So it should be three orders, but only two combos. Yes, ma'am. Okay, that's perfect. Y'all, that sun is blinding your girl. Okay, anywho, like I was saying, I'm gonna have to keep this right here, y'all, because that sun is blinding your girl. Okay, but yeah, I'm gonna go home. I'm gonna read y'all the to do list because baby, it's a lot on us. And y'all already know today is the 27th. That means we move out tomorrow. That is so exciting. No, we actually don't move out tomorrow. We move out on the 29th because that's when the movers come. The movers come the 29th. We get our TV mounted on the 30th. Yeah, so that's the whole dealio with that so far. So I'm excited because y'all get to get a tour tomorrow. Like y'all get to get a whole um, full um, apartment tour tomorrow. So I'm freaking excited. Yeah, so that's freaking lit. The apartment tour is gonna be this vloggy. But don't y'all be skipping ahead, okay? Just go ahead and watch it all the way throughout. Yes, I'm so excited, y'all. So excited. But today, y'all, we got a lot of stuff to get done. We got a lot of packing up to do. Kind of want to go back home and take a nap. I'm not going to lie, y'all. But I'm trying to talk myself out of it. I'm trying to tell myself, okay, girl, you do not need to go home and take a nap. So good. Okay, let me cut my little heater on while I talk to y'all. Oh, my heater on. Let's turn the heater on while I talk to the girl. So, y'all, clearly, as y'all can see, your girl is back at the hen house. And I want to go ahead and get y'all a to do list for today. I feel like I haven't done an actual sit down to do list with y'all in forever. As I told y'all, today is April 27th. Ooh. The heat is so warm my little feet. We have tonight to stay here and we have tomorrow night to stay here. Here's to-do list. So I wanted to vlog today, which we're doing right now. I need to go get a new charger from Best Buy, which I ordered one last night. I don't know if y'all can see that first one. Best Buy notified me 13 minutes ago that my order was ready for pickup. And y'all know that, well, y'all probably don't know this, but they don't open till 10 a.m. Currently it's 9.51, but by the time I make it there, it'll be 10. I'm trying to sit my phone. So yeah, I need to go pick up my charge from Best Buy. I need to go check the mail because I'm hoping it's like some little, um, y'all know how like when you get mail, it be like junk papers that you just don't need. So hopefully I find like some junk mail. That way I can wrap those candles up that y'all see sitting back here. I want to wrap those. And then it's actually some shot glasses in the kitchen that I also want to wrap up. And then it's some stuff that we still have on the shelf. Now on my side of the shelf is just shoes. It's just a bunch of shoe boxes because baby, I got a whole lot of shoes. On Joseph's side is more clothes that need to go, need to get put up. So once it cleans out this bag, I'm going to put the rest of the stuff on the shelf up. I need to pack the bathroom shower. So it's just like, I think I got some exfoliator in there, which I exfoliated and shaved yesterday. So I can go ahead and put my exfoliation thing up. And then there's some stuff in the shower that I actually need to just throw away. I go to work at 7 in the evening tonight. I hate going to work tired. So I'm definitely going to take a nap before I go to work. And I'm not going to rush myself to get everything done if I can't get it done. Because we still have an extra day to come back and clean this apartment up. Yeah, that's pretty much tea. Hope y'all are doing good, friends. Let me know what's tea in the comments. Um, How are y'all doing? Do y'all have anything exciting going on? Is anybody? Because I know this is right around graduation time. It is around prom time. I know some people are going to prom because I know the 
end of April was around the time that I went to prom. So, which it'll be May when y'all see this, but yeah, like, we'll see. I know it's around graduation time. I know a lot of people are moving. I know a lot of people just moved. So, if y'all have anything exciting that y'all want to share in the comments, feel free to let me know. I love seeing good things happen for people. It literally just warms my heart. But yeah, we about to go, y'all, because I need to go to Best Buy, even though I want to get back in the bed and take a nap, but I'm not. But it's only so many limited things I can do on my to-do list for right now. And let me show y'all what y'all sitting on, because I'm not gonna lie, I don't mind having this tripod, but I have such a smaller tripod. So the fact that I'm like on this big bulky one just has me like, where's my small tripod? Joseph think I packed it up and I don't remember packing it up or I accidentally threw it in a box. Because I just had the tripod not that long ago, y'all. Like I literally just freaking had the tripod like two days ago. Hopefully that comes up when we're cleaning or something. Wait a damn minute. Yeah, so I'm trying to be so lazy. I'm just trying to take the easy route out to do everything today. I did not want to go inside the Best Buy to pick this up. I wanted to do curbside pickup. And when I went to the email, they're going to say, Hi, Michaela, your order is ready for in-store pickup. Curbside pickup isn't available for your order. Please come into the store to pick it up. It's just a cord. Like, why isn't curbside available? Yeah. <clears throat> uh -huh. Y'all, I literally hate this. Best about talking about some quick and easy, quick and easy. No, it was not quick and easy. If it was quick and easy, I would have been able to do curbside pickup, and I went ahead to walk outside. Okay, it's so windy outside, y'all, and it's really not even cool. I mean, it's cool, but it's not cold. It's like 66 degrees, but it's so windy. Back home we go, y'all. I literally hate this huge tripod. Y'all don't get it. Like it just looks so big and bulky compared to my normal tripod that I use. Y'all, of course, my battery is about to. <laughs> I feel like dang why do I even tell y'all my battery's gonna die cuz it's always gonna die Y'all so we got our charger Y'all I'm so freaking excited because I finally got my charger so I can finally charge my computer again It's freaking lit So excited is K baby Y'all we back in mother freaking action y'all see the charging fine we lit Okay y'all so your girl had wrapped her hair back up because I just got tired of it being down in my face And I actually got some editing done so I edited it for like an hour I'll say it is now 1237 my charger been acting wonky y'all I literally don't know what's going on I went and bought a brand new charger and it wasn't working so I left it off the charger I was like you know what I'm gonna get whatever editing I can get done till it die they ended up dying on me I plugged it back into this outlet it didn't work neither one of these outlets are working to charge my MacBook I was like you know what I'm gonna just leave it alone for a little bit and I went and plugged it up in the bedroom where I typically have my phone plugged up and now it's charging so I'm gonna just let it get some charge i'm gonna wait and let it get some charge and i'm gonna just get some stuff around the house done okay y'all so um oh i look crazy i look crazy right now y'all because i got this big bonnet on my head thanks baby um so y'all right now i'm about to pack my shoes up going through all my shoes and i'm trying to see what i'm gonna keep what i'm gonna get rid of so i think i'm gonna keep this pair because i really love these shoes like these are so cute to me and i kind of want to try everything on to make sure everything fits your girl can walk in it the only shoes I'm gonna keep out is probably like some little slides, some jandals or something. Okay, so y'all, we keeping these. We're keeping these, cause y'all know I love these. But I think I'm gonna throw this box away. I'm gonna throw it away after we move though, I think. Oh, definitely keeping these. Y'all know I love these, babe. <laughs> I have practically cleaned out the whole bottom of the closet. Let me show y'all. So these are all the shoes that are not in shoe boxes that I need to put up that I'm actually gonna keep. And then these are the shoes that I'm gonna get rid of. I'm getting rid of this pair. I'm getting rid of these and I'm getting rid of those. Okay, I'm just gonna clean them up and then I'm um, gonna get rid of them. And then these are all the shoes that Joseph is getting rid of that he doesn't really wear. And then as y'all can see, we got stuff literally all over the freaking place. Let me show y'all the closet though. Okay, so as y'all can see, I, oh, I gotta take them shoes and put them in the 
um in the front there's literally nothing in the closet floor um it just needs to be swept and mopped but it ain't none on the floor and it's nothing on the shelf oh there's something down there i need to go see. okay y'all so i'm just about to clean these shoes real quick because i'm gonna get rid of them but i just want to make sure like they you know clean at least So I went ahead and cleaned this. This was like the little toilet holder. Since we do have like whites in our bathrooms, I decided that we can go ahead and keep this. And if we decide to get a new one, we just get a new one. I think I'm about to go ahead and take this ring light down, which is practically already down because this part, y'all know this part is so broke, child. So yeah, I'm about to go ahead and take this down. And then I think I'm about to tape up another box. That way I can get more stuff up. I never listened, no. All this shit you was spitting so unoriginal. But it was you, so I was with it. Damn, baby. Good morning, friends. Ah, it's time. Y'all know what time it is. Uh, 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 keys, 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 bookie book. Y'all see it, keys, 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 bookie book. Y'all know what time it is. Uh, uh. Good morning, friends. It's a new day. And excuse my little friend right here. Um. Can you not? It's too early. Bae, <laughs> he played too much. Y'all, excuse my little friend right here because I really have been on this wave of not picking in my face. So maybe y'all just gonna have to see it, okay? So I find my um little patches. I was trying to find them in the bathroom, but I forgot we literally didn't clean everything out. So it literally ain't nothing in there. But good morning, good morning, good morning. So today is the 28th, baby. Y'all know it's time. It's, it's that day, okay? Which is not the day, but it's the day you know let me go ahead and explain a little detail okay today is 28 so y'all know we get the keys today we want to go do the apartment tour today so baby excitement okay through the roof <laughs> so yeah we're going to go tour the apartment today now the plan is to i don't know if we're going to pack these clothes up first or if we're going to go in um tour the apartment and clean and do all of that first but i know for one i need to go to walmart because we need to get a few um cleaning supplies i need to see what we have and what we need to get and then i know for sure i need to get some paper towels that's tea first of all yes today is the 28th we get the keys today now our movers don't come until tomorrow meaning that we get the keys today but we don't move in today so we won't be moving any of our stuff in unless it's stuff that we carry by car which is probably going to be just shoes and clothes for the most part because that's the only thing that we really didn't box up and then like the tv well i don't even know i think i don't know if the movers is going to take tv or, or or if we're just going to put it in the truck but that's basically what we'll move for the most part so if anything the closet will be furnished before anything because we'll probably end up taking that stuff today as y'all can see your girl got her roby on so i need to take this off and actually put on some clothes to prepare for today but yes that's tea so far we get the keys today the movers will be here tomorrow okay but today's gonna be an exciting day like i'm so freaking lit y'all y'all literally don't even know hey siri what's the weather outside the weather outside is like oh uh of course it's 67 and of course i need to expect rain it's always raining the weather outside is delightful some 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 frightful <laughs> i don't even know the lyrics um babe you think i should put actually hey babe have you seen my little uh oh never mind Found them, found them, found them. Babe, can you pull these off the hanger for me, them gray sweats? Oh, babe, I'ma just put my camo top on. Five May 4th. How scissors gonna be in the building? That's a Blue Orleans bounce artist. We gonna be in the building, or is we gonna be in the building? Okay, y'all, let me quit BSing and put some clothes on for real, and I'm gonna get back on the cam. Okay, let me see if I can find some panties, because y'all know your girl that packs every, y'all can't see me. Y'all know your girl that packs everything up. So let's try to find some panties. Babe, I don't think I have no panties in here. I didn't pull out enough drawers. That's insanity, Michaela. You need to do better. I thought you said scissor. <laughs> Scissor. Okay, y'all. So I don't have any underwear. Let me tell y'all what I'm finna do. Let me tell y'all what you do when you can't find no underwear. I'm 
What you do? So y'all, when you can't find no underwear, you either put on your man's underwear or you go and find you some underwear. So today we're gonna take it, putting on Joseph's underwear since I can't find my underwear. It's crazy because I'm the one who packs our stuff. I put him enough pairs of underwear, but I ain't put me enough pairs of panties. Like, how does that work? And now I'm just about to put my sweats on y'all. Y'all know, baby, I love these sweats. I love them, I love them. And y'all, these sweats is from, well, no, they not, well, Technically, they from Zara, but I got them from TJ Maxx because I'm a Zara girly to a certain extent, but it's just like certain stuff I'm just not about to pay for it. You know what I'm saying? I'm not paying $40, $50 on sweats. Sorry. <laughs> just because of a certain brand, not doing it. These are actually Zara's brand, but I found them at TJ Maxx for like $8.99. Like, I'll pay $20 for some sweats, but I'm just not paying $50, $60, $70. $50. Like, I really gotta love the sweats. It's so crazy, y'all, because as much as like I love fashion, I'm becoming such a minimalist. I feel like sometimes I'd be forcing myself to take pictures in outfits because social media is what I like to do. But I'm kind of like having that vibe where it's like I only want to dress up when I go on vacation. I just becoming such a minimalist where I just don't really care to do the most. So yeah, we wearing Zara sweats, gray. And then baby, you know my body. Y'all already know what shirt I'm putting on. Come on now. Black Diamond, Black Diamond Apparel, BDA. Y'all already know. Go shop the brand. Link will always be in my description box, okay? And I don't know if I ever formally told y'all what Black Diamond stood for, like what What's the meme behind it? What would you call it? Like the slogan that goes with it? You no know, pressure, no diamonds, no struggle, no strength. Basically, I mean, it's pretty self-explanatory, but without pressure, you 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 can't be a diamond. To have a diamond, you must go through extreme pressure, extreme heat. You know what I'm saying? No pressure, no diamonds. No struggle, no strength. It, it's kind of hard to be strong when you ain't never struggled. And that's how we learn our biggest strengths. And you know, that's how we learn life experience going through struggles. So never be afraid to struggle. Never be afraid to go through the journey. And that's basically what Black Diamond stands for. Because I know some people probably are curious, like, okay, what is that brand about? Because I never like formally sat down and told y'all what the brand was. So it's a brand Joseph came up with back in the day. And as y'all can see, it's on his back. No pressure, no diamonds, no struggle, no strength. And then right here, it just has a quote that says, strength comes from the struggle. Yeah, we literally have like a whole bunch of um different kind of logos and stuff. And that's the logo for this shirt. But yeah, y'all, that's pretty much what um Black Diamond is. Because I know for me, like if it's especially like a kind of like a t-shirt brand or like an actual brand, I'm like, okay, what does this brand represent? Because I don't like just putting anything on my body, you know? So I just wanted to let y'all know and tell y'all that that's the meaning behind it's the struggle, baby. It's the struggle. That's the meaning behind it. I probably shouldn't get undressed with y'all on camera, so I'm gonna just, I'm gonna come back. We motherfucking home, okay? Y'all, I'm so freaking excited. Like, y'all, mm -hmm. oh, I'm so geek. Yes, TV right there. Mm hmm. Okay, y'all, so it's freaking lit. Clearly, ooh, my head all types of love side. Y'all, please excuse how I'm looking right now because the girl's looking a little rough. I'm about to go ahead and give y'all an apartment tour. Y'all, hold on, my battery is dying, but when I get back on, we finna do the apartment tour. Okay, y'all, I told y'all when I change the battery, baby, we're finna do the apartment tour. So right now, as y'all can see, your girl is standing in front of the front door. So this is she, this is just the locks and stuff. I'm talking about stuff y'all don't even care about. Let me flip the cam. So right here, we got the tall front door. And then right here, I think it's just like the water heater. I'm gonna actually show y'all. So yeah, just the water heater. When you come to the right, you have the refrigerator. We got the freezer in this junk. We got the, <laughs> I ain't gonna open it. We got the fridge part. And then right up here, y'all, we got like extra um, space. So up there is like gonna go wines. Me and Joseph are gonna go get some wines and champagnes. So it's gonna go at the top. And then we're not really sure what's gonna go right here. If anything, it'll probably just be like, well, honestly, I don't know. Cause I was gonna say chips and stuff, but since we have so much cabinet space, I'm probably not gonna put chips in there. Chips is probably gonna go in the pantry. So I don't know yet. And then y'all, let's talk about the detailing. Okay, this is like the countertop space. And let's just talk about the gold and the brown detailing across the back. Like the backsplash is everything. And then let's talk about how you got outlets, literally. <laughs> all the way around. Okay, we gonna get there in a second. But y'all, we literally have all this cabinet space. So, cabinet space, cabinet space, like baby. You literally have so much freaking cabinet space. Your girl gonna have to get on the, get on the counter just to get to the top. Oh yeah, we got cabinet one, we got cabinet two. 
okay? It's pretty much the same thing, so I'm not gonna be opening every single cabinet, but y'all see the gist, okay? Another one, and then right here, me and Joseph was thinking strictly only dishes. We can have wine glasses, you can have like drinking glasses, plates, bowls, all of that, so just like our glass, our glass dishes are gonna be right here, okay? I don't know how I just skipped over the microwave. Then we had a microwave, y'all. So very generic, very basic, just like a stainless steel microwave. And then y'all, we have the oven, which is so sleek, so nice. Y'all, I've been waiting to have a flat oven for so long. And then you just have the inside of the oven. And then y'all know where black folks store their dishes, <laughs> but you know, <laughs> um, to keep your food warm, I think. It's like a food warmer, but I know black folks store their dishes. Black folks put their food in the oven or in the microwave, <laughs> okay? So yeah, y'all know what that is. It's literally on every oven. That's tea right there. And then y'all, we have more cabinet space, which is probably gonna go for seasonings for the most part. I wanna like label the seasonings all cute and get them all organized, but babe, it's gonna be another day, another vlog. And then of course, like under cabinet space, you know, for like cleaning and stuff and just little stuff like that. Of course, this is where the sink is at. Deep sink, babe, okay? Real deep, really nice sink, so yeah. So then we got more cabinet space and y'all, I just literally love how there are outlets all around like no you cannot borrow my charger plug it up down there and then this is the uh disposal i think yep and then this is the lights to light up like all up under here <laughs> babe you see the vibe okay you see the vibe and then when you come right over y'all you just have your pantry go ahead and open it up and so that's why i said we're probably not going to store chips over there because we got literally this whole freaking pantry this is the pantry it's very very spacious y'all oh where it go They'll go super high up, but it's like super duper, oopa, oopa, loopa, spacious. So once you come from the pantry, this is where you see the living area, okay? This is the full living area right here. Honestly, my favorite part about the living room is this, okay? Y'all know I cannot wait to decorate. Like, I cannot wait to put decorations right here. It just looks so sleek. It looks super nice, and I'm like, I'm freaking excited, okay? Then you just have the blinds right here, and then you have... This is where the balcony is gonna be. I was telling Joseph for the balcony, I want to get, y'all excuse my hair looking all crazy, but I was telling him I wanna get like some fake grass to put on the balcony. I feel like it'll be such a vibe. So this is the living room for me standing in the living room. Here is the kitchen. Oh, I didn't never show y'all this, but this is of course gonna be where the washer and dryer goes. I just love how everything is super spacious. Like you don't have to cram something that's not meant to cram in another area. Like I don't have to cram dish detergent and you know, stuff to wash the clothes in the bathroom or in another closet. You know what I'm saying? Like I can literally store everything in here. Super freaking spacious, real cute. But these are like two shelves that we have for washer and dryer stuff, okay? And honestly, y'all, I love that because it just makes it super organized and you don't have to go and look for something oh where did I put this or where did I store this at you know what I'm saying so yeah and then y'all we have of course thermostat and then these are just like the different light fixtures I don't think these go to any of these though what is that turning on and off oh okay this light right here is like these are the fixtures so it's like this little hallway kind of studio light that's right here that you can turn on and off what did that flip off okay so it's two fixtures that go to this light because there's one over there by the door that goes to this light and then it's clearly this one that goes to that light right here y'all we just have this this is like across from the bedroom we just have this closet and it's just like a little coat closet so i don't really know how we'll use this at the moment but we'll figure it out and this is gonna be the bedroom so as y'all can see it's um the blinds are right there and then it's just like a pretty spacious um size bedroom this is where the bed's gonna go and then, of course, right here is where the TV is gonna go. Y'all know I'm excited, I'm geeked about it, okay? The bed is actually gonna get um, delivered tomorrow. Yeah, of course, I'll show y'all like that whole process. The bed will be getting delivered tomorrow. The TV will also be, I think the TV, if it's not getting delivered tomorrow, actually, I think we're gonna put the TV in a truck or it might go with the movers. I'm not sure yet, but the TV is gonna be getting mounted on the 30th, which is Sunday, I wanna say. Sunday, Monday, something like that. So it'll be getting mounted sometime this week. And then, can we focus, babe? Let me give y'all like a little another spin of the bedroom. So yeah, the bedroom is bedrooming. And then once you leave the bedroom, y'all my favorite freaking part. Well, one of my favorite freaking parts. We have the bathroom. Y'all, It is when I tell y'all it is so big, like I don't even think the camera is doing it justice on how huge the bathroom really is. Like it is freaking huge. Y'all see this big freaking mirror? Y'all, this is huge. And so then you just have the double sink. So this is one and then this is the other sink. And then you have, it's a lot of bathroom space. I think that's another thing that I really love y'all. 
it's a lot of bathroom space. It's like a lot of storage. Your girl be having so much stuff that I be needing to storage. Got the two double sinks. And then this is just storage for under um, the sink. We have these three drawers because we don't really want to have too much on the counter. This is drawer number one, drawer number two. This is drawer number three. We just have the other side of the double sink we can, which can store. And then we have these two big cabinets. Okay, and this is probably where most of my hair stuff and just like facial stuff is gonna go if not in those cabinets. But this is probably where most of the hair stuff is gonna go. I'm so glad that this one actually has layers. So I mean like the shelves in it so I can actually be a lot more organized. And then this one has shelving which towels are most likely gonna go in this one right here. And then I'll just have some organization going on and something else will go like above the towels or under the towels. So let me give y'all like a little tour because I know y'all like to be seeing like a little 360. So let me go ahead and give it to y'all. Boom, da -dum, da -dum. And then this is the the shower y'all which is so sleek it's so nice it has black towel this is like the little circular tub it's so cute I love how deep it is this is the black toweling in the shower and then we need to go find some shower curtains this is like to put um well you can pretty much put anything right here soap whatever you want to put this is tea I'm excited and then y'all so here is the toilet just a regular regular toilet and then I want to get like a nice little frame to go right here either a painting or just something to go above the toilet and then get like decorative towels to match the bathroom so this is like another um spin like another 360 so y'all can just get like a different angle so yeah that is the bathroom it's t girl when i have y'all sitting right here and we doing our makeup together like what don't play with it don't play with it don't play with it okay to open it oh yeah we need the air to be yes. flowing. And so then y'all, here is the closet, babe. It's literally my favorite freaking part. So yeah, this is the closet. I'm freaking excited, okay? So we have like this whole little storage area. My rings can get organized, my sunglasses, like literally everything, okay? And so then this is the first level. So you have one level of storage right here. You have another one on this side. And then you have a second level right here that can go all the way around. And then you freaking have a third level which your girl can't reach. But yeah, it's another level that go all the freaking way around. It is a three level closet storage. So baby, y'all know we gonna be in here getting ready, picking outfits. We gonna be doing the whole nine, okay? I'm just geeked about it. Like that was one of my biggest things, y'all. I wanted a really spacious kitchen. I wanted a really spacious bathroom and I wanted a really spacious closet because I had to think about, okay, okay, where do you spend most of your time, you know? And I feel like the living room is like joint socializing, you know? Like unless me and Joseph in the living room watching TV, for the most part, I'm either spending most of my time in the kitchen because I'm cooking or I'm just talking to y'all in the kitchen or I'm in the bathroom or I be in the closet. So those are like the three things that I wanted to be very spacious and I'm so happy because all three of those are very freaking spacious. And then the living room is, it's such a good sizing because it's enough room to have a good size couch. You can do like a two piece couch and then you could do like a little coffee table and you just got your TV like that be what's tape for real y'all finna take this head off because it's freaking hot so that is the official apartment tour so i'm excited y'all we're probably gonna start we need to go to the store and get some stuff to start cleaning today and then we can go to the house and grab some candles and light some candles and stuff because i want to like clean the sink out clean the counters down clean the pantry all the cabinets like i want to go ahead and clean all of that you want to get a new mop today too so yeah, y'all about to come with us because we about to go to the store and just grab some cleaning stuff. And then y'all, something that I wanted to get for like the mirror because babe, who is spraying down this big ass mirror and wiping it? I want to get a squeegee. So I want like a silver one since the bathroom is mostly silver or I'll get it like a black one. And I'll, um, of course, like, you know, have it somewhere in here stored. But I want to get a squeegee to squeegee the mirrors because the mirror is so big that I want to have a squeegee. And I was going to get a squeegee anyway because um, I want like a big, I forget what they call the mirrors, but I want like a big mirror in the living room. So yeah, that's that. So yeah, I hope that y'all are excited for the journey. I hope y'all are excited to do get ready with your girl. Like, and it's so crazy. Y'all gonna close this door because Joseph and they're watching something. But when I just think about y'all, like, I'm gonna sit y'all up because y'all know I'm already itching to sit y'all up. When I just think about y'all, like, where I came from, if you're new here, because I know, like, the moving series 
moving blog part one just about going viral it's already over a thousand views and that's new for me i'm just like a thousand people have watched my video just like a little backstory about me in case like you are new here you just subscribe and you become you know part of the gang 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 welcome 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 girl or boy and you're gonna love it here okay but like basically i've always been like pretty well off and i'm not gonna lie adulting started hitting me when i moved out i moved out from with my mom back in 2021 something like that it was somewhere around that time 2021 or 2022 i ended up moving out from with my mom i've literally done so much on my own just being 22 i ended up moving out from with my mom in may i ended up buying my first car on my own no co-signer july of 2022 so that was like two months later i had heard up got me a job i didn't even like the job i think i was working at olive garden at the time y'all and then i started working from home because i was just trying to bring in any kind of money so i could buy me a car i didn't have no co-signer thank god because i've been working on my credit and it's just like the apartment that we were in did i love it no but it was a part of my journey you get what i'm saying so it was a part of where we are today you know so um yeah it's just like it's so beautiful to just see the journey and i was just thinking i was like literally trying to have my whole life together before we moved in i was trying to have a couch already i was literally trying to have everything but i'm not even rushing no more y'all if i don't furnish the living room until june i'm cool with that i just want to take my time i want to furnish everything how i want to furnish it i don't want to be in a rush to just furnish 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 because i want it to be furnished like it's all in the journey i want to find stuff that i genuinely love i want it to be homey like i want it to be stuff that i'm like okay when i found that i knew i had to have that but yeah y'all my hat looks so i look so rough right now but i just wanted to give y'all like a little um backstory so yeah that's that i'm excited so it's time to level up like it we're taking this up a notch okay i'm freaking excited i gotta finish editing moving vlog episode two because that one's already done filmed this is moving vlog episode three so i'm just i'm <laughs> I'm freaking excited okay yeah i'm done rambling we are about to go out and get some stuff to clean and i'll see y'all when we get back we're also gonna have to stop by the house because i think we're gonna get some stuff to bring over here and like get some candles and stuff like that so yeah i hope y'all enjoyed the tour i love y'all so much and i really appreciate y'all so freaking much y'all like my internet besties you know Okay, y'all, Joseph didn't drop me out at Chick-fil-A because the line was way too long, y'all. Who was standing in that line? And I'm just going in here to get a salad. Where's the line at? Y'all, I look so freaking rough. Hi. It's going to be for to go. Okay, Cobb salad, no bacon. Let me do that with the avocado lime ranch. Can you do? Um, no, that'll be all. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, can I get a cup of water, too? Can I get some napkins? Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Have a great one. Enjoy. Is that yours? Yes, it is. I'm like, how do you have a job here and you can't hear? That's what I'm thinking in my head. Didn't have no kind of hearing aid in. <laughs> okay, y'all. I'm Y'all, this man inside, he kept screaming my name. And I'm like, I'm right here. I'm right here. I'm right here. And then this girl, her name was Lauren. And he called her Morn. And he was like, where's the I-N-G? Trying to be funny. And she's like, uh, my name is Lauren. I don't know where you got Morn from. And then he's sitting there like looking at the bag i'm like oh so you can't hear and you can't see okay <laughs> what's tea but y'all you ready to go oh, God, oh, i'm gonna eat i'm so excited i'm gonna eat good and then me and joseph gonna go clean it's just about to be a day okay so yeah i'm about to start eating y'all and i'm gonna talk to y'all a little later y'all i had to <laughs> i had to cut back on the camera because i am just so funny i'm over here talking about let me see if i can sit y'all up y'all i'm over here talking about i asked joseph i said because he be talking about how small i am and like i don't be eating y'all like literally i probably eat once a day if that which i do need to start eating more because just like for health reasons i should be eating at least twice a day and snacking if not three times a day i need to be at least eating a good breakfast and a good dinner meal like at least or a good lunch and dinner something but i'll literally probably not eat or i'll snack throughout the day and it's just because y'all when i have so much going on last thing i be thinking about is eating which is sad but it's true so i asked y'all if i said you want some of my um i said you want some of my salad some of some nah you need that like you need to eat and so i only said it because you need you didn't eat nothing today so not with all that though <laughs> not little one but yeah so i'm like okay whatever and so then i'm thinking he's saying that because like i'm so like small and i don't be eating i said don't forget you was scrawny back in the day once so don't do that and so then he, he like um, look at me like i'm little 
That's crazy, and you 200 pounds. But look, I'm like, you used to be once upon a time, like scrawny back in the day. I said, wait till I hit my 30s. I'm gonna be fine as wine. I was like, you gonna be 52, talking about, yeah, my woman, you know, she, she 31, I'm 52. <laughs> And I just bust out laughing. He was like, you think I'm gonna sound like that? And I'm like, no, I'm just mocking a man's voice. Cause I thought that was so funny, which I don't yeah. even I don't even know if that aging is accurate. 52 and 31. If y'all didn't know me and Joseph, we 14 years apart. I just thought I'd tell y'all. That's my little baby. And it's crazy because now nah, I'm your little baby. <laughs> Bye. And y'all, Joseph sent me this. He sent me this thing on Instagram the other day that was like, uh, Women be 25 and they man be what 57 and then yeah, it was like women be 25 and they man be 57 Talking about my man be spoiling me. Yeah, he think you his grandchild and I <laughs> <laughs> That was so funny to me y'all. It's so crazy because before I tell people after I say this I'm gonna really get off because I ain't got nowhere to sit the camera because Joseph's driving now It's so funny y'all because before I tell people like the age gap that me and Joseph have people don't be believing me because he looks so young So it's just like I already look young because when you are young you typically look young unless you know you're doing stuff that's aging you quicker than you know you're supposed to age but that's not your girl so it's so funny because when i actually tell people our age difference people be like wow like for real it's so funny to me but yeah y'all that was just funny i wanted to get on here and share that with y'all but i'm about to eat y'all look at this salad baby she looks so good she looks so fine so i'm about to eat a salad and then i'm gonna get back with y'all a little later on can you get a basket baby good how are you Okay, y'all, so we are back. We are at Family Dollar. We about to just get some stuff that we need. Once we leave Family Dollar, I think we're gonna go back to the other apartment because I just need to pull my hair back. Since we're gonna be cleaning this stuff, I just don't want my hair all in my face and all over the place. I'm gonna go home and pull my hair back in a ponytail. A Swiffer or a mop? I think a mop. I prefer Lysol, it smells better. Y'all, so while I'm up here finishing and cleaning stuff, Joseph get bored, he talking about something. I'm gonna go get me some snacks. <laughs> snacks? We didn't come here for no snacks. Hey, what you looking for? Snacks. You got snacks? What you looking for? Snacks. Snacks. What you want some? No, I don't want no snacks. They ain't have enough snacks for you at the front. Daddy. Oh, I wanted some sugar daddies one day, yep. That's sugar babies. I like the daddies. I, I like the actual sucker. What kind of candy you got? Let me see. I'm trying to say they got a bigger pack over here. Five for a dollar, they talking about a dollar fifty. That's why you're going to be in the gym now, right? Yeah, I've always been eating like this, though, baby. It's not something, something I just started. Okay, y'all. We're going to be sitting in the candy aisle for a minute to just to get all his little snacks. Let me see what flavor they got. <laughs> now he tell me something. They got rips. You want some? I'm not. I'm not stunned for the camera. I just ask you what flavor they had. Oh my gosh, they got cookies. This man is in heaven. <laughs> you getting them cookies? Fucking right. You need to start coming to Family Dollar for your snacks. I know. They got that yeah in this bitch. Digging this big pack of peanut butter cookies. Yeah, man. Them bitches. I used to eat them bitches back in the. Y'all remember how off everybody hate Chris? What's her name off? What was the mama name off everybody hate Chris? Rochelle? Y'all remember how Rochelle used to always eat these turtles? She used to love that candy on everybody hate Chris. So Joseph see the candy, he liked turtles. I was like, the chocolate? And he was like, yeah. I was like, those are nasty. I don't like those. And he was like, I never had them. And I'm like, yeah, you used to give me them nasty ass candies for Valentine's Day. And he looked at me like, huh? <laughs> That's hilarious. Babe, these are so good. Cherry, watermelon, blue raspberry. These the chewy ones? OMG. I'm not a cookie person. I promise you don't have to worry about me touching none of your cookies. Babe, I haven't seen these junks in so long. If you know, you know. My granny used to have these in a bowl. Yes, my granny used to have these in a bowl. Like these used to be one of the candies in a candy bowl. Yes, those used to be the candies in a candy bowl. Okay, I'm done on the candy aisle. I only got one candy. I got these Jolly Rancher Chews and they gonna be so freaking fire. Y'all, these are literally so good, like obsessed, okay? Okay, you ready? OMG. I gotta get a big bag of these. Ugh, gotta have these. Girl, it's tired and I look so crazy. I'm, I'm just gonna take this hat off, y'all. Because there ain't no sense in just having it. Hold oh, on. Geez. Oh, y'all, tell me why me and Joseph in. Hey, let me see them. That Kit Kat you got? He already in the open mm. stuff and started eating it. They good? <laughs> look at him trying to feed me. Mm. Mm -mm. Y'all, so. Y'all, so. Oh, child. Please excuse my head. Those are hot. Yeah, it's hot. Oh, shit. Yeah. Mm -mm -mm. Y'all. about right? 
Yeah, it is about to rain. Why was we at the store? I'm just like talking, you know? I'm like, Joseph, I'm like, they got blueberry muffin Kit Kat. He was like, what? Where? What, when I tell y'all this man is a snack, a snack head, he gonna have some snacks. And he like, oh, I need, I need to try one of them. There's so many snacks in those bags. I'm gonna have to show y'all when we get to the apartment. It's literally so many snacks. That house is gonna be snacked up, one thing about it. Cause leave it up to him, we gonna have some snacks. And then y'all, so me and Joseph love Ruffles. Like that's one of our favorite brand of chips is Ruffles. And so we typically get cheddar and sour cream ones or like the cheddar barbecue ones. But we was in there, I guess Joseph had went down the chip out and he had saw, or were those on the end? Those on the end of the aisle? He yeah, saw these honey habanero chips, so he wanted to try them because we always get like this kind of like the chips we usually get. So they honey habanero, but they hot y'all. They too hot for me. I can't eat them. They got like a kick to them. Oh, it's hot to me. But y'all, we about to head back to the old place. I'm about to pull my hair back because while we cleaning and stuff, I just don't want my hair like everywhere. Um, we just gonna get some stuff from the house, like some candles and stuff, some stuff like that. We gonna get from another place. And I'm gonna get my laptop too. We just got our new apartment. We gon' leave the floors wet. Walk around that naked. Nobody can tell us. Sh yeah, I'm just so excited. Like, I'm so excited to freaking decorate. You know, like that new moving feeling, just new energy, like new everything, you know? Babe, what you looking for? No, that's the wrong, babe. And the light green, the light green. And he looking for snacks. That's on the go snacks. Why, cause we ain't went grocery shopping You yet? know what on the go snacks mean? <laughs> What you eating? Let me see. Blueberry muffins. Let me see what color they use. Oh, it's a blueberry muffin cake. Just said these taste just like blueberry muffins, y'all. Let's see. Oh, better. It really do. See what I'm saying? You want it or you don't? Mm-mm. Come here, Hey friends, y'all we back. Okay y'all, so let me go ahead and update y'all. I know y'all, it's been a little minute. I haven't talked to y'all since I was in the car. So me and Joseph ended up coming in because I needed to wrap my hair up for one and he started wrapping the clothes up while I was wrapping my hair up. Y'all, it starts pouring, literally pouring raining, okay? It started pouring outside. Of course we are not about to move nothing. We are not about to do none of that in the rain because it's a no go. First of all, I'm not running back and forth in the rain. I'm not getting soaked. I, I don't have time for that. But it's not supposed to rain tomorrow because y'all know how I told y'all I ended up washing my car mats and I was like, I want to wash my car, but it's going to rain until Friday. So I kind of knew it was going to rain today. I wasn't too sure just because I know, child, you know, Texas weather, you don't know if it's going to rain, if it's going to be sunny. You really don't know what it's going to do. So I was like, huh? I don't know. So it actually ended up raining so right now we literally getting everything together i'm working in the kitchen now getting everything together and then we just gonna move out throughout the house so we have already got some stuff done down i'm about to show y'all so we ended up getting this mirror down which if y'all don't know it was actually right here on this wall because the tv right here and so the mirror was literally right here it was against the wall with command strips these y'all know these that say love much dream big laugh out loud live so these were actually back here on the wall oh that paint is terrible so it was up there and it was another one up there y'all my battery is literally about to die but what's new child so yeah they were literally right there i'm gonna end up i don't know if we're just gonna throw them away or at this point i just i want to give stuff away but it's because i don't want to take anything like literally whoever want it need it just get it out like i don't even want no money for it just come take it yeah but by the time y'all watching this it'll already be gone y'all have to just keep up with me on the media meaning like instagram tiktok other sources like that you know i'm about to start cleaning and i'm gonna just give y'all like a montage of me starting out everything and stuff like that so yeah oh also hold on y'all let me change my battery so i can tell y'all what just happened y'all i was cracking up hold on okay y'all i have to go change my battery babe y'all know my batteries be dying my batteries don't last a day so i got two batteries on the charger right now we on my last battery but hopefully by the time this one ends up dying the other two will be charged so or at least one of them will be charged when i tell y'all i've had these batteries on the charger back to back to back because babe we got content to get out okay but i wanted to tell y'all joseph is so funny y'all like the glimpse that y'all get of him he is literally hilarious okay so tell me why earlier i told you how we was cleaning y'all so we started bagging everything well joseph honestly did all this he bagged the clothes and stuff so far right like he started bagging everything this shirt was thrown on the bed i typically have it hung up in the closet it was on the bed and he asked me are these shirts clean are they dirty and i'm like wait this was hanging up this definitely isn't dirty and he was like babe what you had said about this shirt why you didn't um why you didn't put it in the trash bags with the other ones you already know why Huh? You know why? Because it got one sleeve on it. <laughs> what you? It's not going to hang up on the, in that bag like that, right? It's not going to hang up because it's got one sleeve on it? Yeah. What All you? Right. You're going to put this on the hanger, then what? Put the other side on there. How? What are you? <laughs> 
What do you, y'all, Joseph said he can hang this up. He said it's only got one sleeve on it. Let me lay it out so y'all can see. Joseph said he can't hang my shirt up because it's only got one sleeve on it. It's a bodysuit, y'all, but he said he couldn't hang it up because it only got one sleeve. But I had it hanging up in the closet. You didn't see it hanging up? Yeah, but it was. <laughs> it was doing the beanie weenie. <laughs> Y'all, that is so hilarious to me. Oh my goodness. My, my yeah, your Timberlands is packed. Why? The, the bronze. Yeah, they packed. You better put your damn work, you better put your work boots on. <laughs> better go get them steel toes. What you going outside for? A news flash, y'all. We actually about to go to the apartment now. Y'all, look, we don't even have the handy dandy calendar up in them. She on the floor. She's not up here anymore. Hey friends, so y'all, I forgot to hop back on here cause child, we been, we was towing so much to the car. So as y'all can see, we literally have all this and I have two more bags in the trunk. We was towing so much to the car because we decided that we was gonna spend a night because we don't know what the weather is gonna do for one. Like, let me show y'all. As y'all can see the sky, like it's, it's gray, it's dark. It was raining earlier and then it stopped raining. So we figured we would just go on cause we need to clean up today because we are not trying to clean and unpack at the same time. It's just gonna be too much. So we're gonna be cleaning up tonight and we figured we'll just spend a night that way we ain't got to be trying to get back out you know in the weather and stuff like that so we just gonna stay over there for the night so we pack like a whole sleeping bag and stuff so we're at the liquor store right now i actually don't know what he's getting out of there and then we gotta go to walmart we need to get some wine glasses mop in a broom and then just like loop a towel let me tell you everything we got on the list to get out of here which is not too much let's see how fast we can get it and get out oh glass is not even on this aisle so y'all we got water now i'm thinking we just gonna get some iceland water because we really don't need a big old case right now and with everything we got a total in we probably not gonna get a big case so we probably just gonna get the pack of eight the iceland water because the iceland glacial water hit different okay so we got water we need to get a mop we need to get a broom because the old broom that we got we're throwing it away okay we need to get a loofah i already told y'all for when we shower we need a loofah we just got a pack of glasses those are so cute i can't wait till we get to the house so i can show y'all these glasses i need to get some leaves so those are cute too we can get to them yeah We have made it back to the house, y'all. Y'all know the last time I talked to y'all, we was in Walmart. And we just got like a few things that we would need for tonight. I'm about to flip the camera. I would show y'all everything that we got. I'll probably show y'all everything like later on. But y'all can see Joseph is over there cleaning. And then also, y'all, we ended up getting some wine. We got some rosé. We got Bel Air. We also have, ooh, and it's good and cold. We got um, Josh Sellers. And then we have rosé, barefoot. We have some Roscato. This is basically just to go ahead and start like our wine collection. Cause I know the wine collection gonna be lit. <laughs> that boy wiping that mirror down. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Y'all about to take this off because I'm hot. And I'm about to start putting some stuff up. So I'm about to sit y'all up and baby, y'all about to get this hot. <laughs> What's up, friends? So, let me tell y'all what I just found out. Cause baby, I've been on the phone, and let me, actually, let me get my wine too. Y'all been sipping on my wine. Yeah, definitely feeling it. Gonna let y'all know that now. Lately, y'all, this is what I've been trying to do. I've been trying to, like, contain my focus. Like, I was telling y'all earlier in the car that I have reels that I still need to post on Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok. I wanna start posting reels on all three platforms, and YouTube. Like, why do I feel like I don't have enough time? And it's like, girl, you don't even do nothing with your time, so how you don't have enough time? Joseph and my homegirl, Maddie, they was telling me that you can literally schedule times for certain apps on your phone. If you're on Instagram or if you're on TikTok and you set a timer that says, okay, I only want to spend three hours on Instagram throughout the whole day. That's an hour for like each part of the day. So you can do that literally with any app on your phone. So I need to do it with Instagram and I need to do it with, I feel like I haven't been on TikTok lately, but I'm gonna still do it with TikTok. I just wanted to tell y'all that because I just found that out tonight and you guys lit about it because maybe I could have been up one. Okay, but it's all a part of the journey. This is everything that we went and got for the day. Ended up getting some regular regular Lysol. Fabuloso. Some, ooh, I didn't smell this. Did you smell this one? Or did I just put this? Did you put this in a part of me? Uh -oh. 
This smells good. Okay, y'all, I don't know if me, or jo me or Joseph put this in the park. That smells good. That smells good, though. We got some scrubbies. Y'all remember all those snacks we got earlier? This is all Joseph has left. This is all he has left. Oh, you got more cookies up there? Oh, and some shortbread lemon cookies. Sorry, my bad. All I ate was the Reese's. <laughs> Baby, you got more than Reese's. Baby, you got more than Reese's. You ate the Reese's. You ate the other pack of Reese's. You ate the damn Kit Kat, so yeah, <laughs> just Reese's. Right quick, oh, you was gonna eat all that right quick. Yeah, was... And you finna eat all them right quick. <laughs> <laughs> y'all, I'm screaming right now. And then y'all, oh, y'all, these are so freaking fine. Like, oh, babe, I love these so much. And it's so crazy because Family Dollar got a lot of old candy. I literally did not know that until we got a Family Dollar. I was telling Joseph, I was like, oh, they got like a lot of old school candy. Stuff you would try to go find at like the corner store or Walmart, they got all the updated candy. Stuff I don't see in Walmart and Target. These are like the um the soft Jolly Ranchers. Oh, let me tell you how the flavors. They got strawberry, y'all. Oh, strawberry. Love that for me. Oh, I didn't get the blue one. Oh, I didn't get the red one either, but I know this cherry. Oh, I'm finna eat one of them right now. You want one? You want some? I'm just trying to get all the flavors out. Y'all, when I tell y'all, baby, I'm about to have the business. Okay, these are about to be the business. For real. Um, let me tell y'all the flavor. So they got strawberry, cherry, which I'm about to eat right now, y'all. Cherry, ugh. This is always my favorite. And it's so crazy because unpopular opinion, nobody likes the cherry. Like, nobody says the cherry is their favorite Jolly Rancher. But the cherry is definitely the best Jolly Rancher. Blue cherry. raspberry, yeah, cherry's always been the best. But cherry has always been the underdog. Cherry is the Jolly Rancher that people hate. They be like, oh, my favorite watermelon and, or green apple. Don't nobody want that sourish. Cherry actually has flavor, but cherry has always been the underdog Jolly Rancher. You know, right? Y'all got what I'm saying? Yeah. Cherry's always been the underdog to me. And then y'all, they got watermelon and they got green apple. Yeah, green apple is kind of my least favorite. I actually like grape over green apple. Don't judge my taste buds. Even though grape don't come in here, kind of sad about that, but whatever. Literally so far. Definitely gonna tell them up. But I really don't snack a lot, so I might have them for a little bit. But like if I'm snacking in a setting i'll eat about five of them maybe six or ten we ended up getting these exfoli did we get these from walmart we got these exfoliating washes ended up getting some magic erasers which typically i normally get the big pack but they didn't have it i need that to clean trash bags also y'all this so juicy and good This Ari Lennox. Cause what she say? Hold on, let me go on. I just got my new apartment. I'm already the clothes wet. Walk around this snakey. Mm -hmm. Get the out my apartment now. 
Y'all, so I literally have been cleaning my little heart out. Okay, so, oh my gosh, I forgot I gotta do these cabinets, y'all. I was gonna say, I'm literally done cleaning the cabinets in the kitchen, but I'm not. So, let me show y'all. Joseph cleaned all the top mirrors, like the glass ones. He cleaned all the top, I mean, not mirrors, all the top cabinets. So, I figured that I would go in and clean all the bottom ones, right? So, I've literally cleaned everything on the bottom, and child, that little bit wore me out. And so, then I'm like, dang. But I did not clean these. Luckily, it's only like one set of cabinets, so it's like a cabinet and a cabinet, so it ain't like doom, 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 you know. So yeah, I'm about to clean this real quick. I'm probably not gonna record it. The countertop. That's literally the only thing else I have left to clean. Joseph also cleaned out the fridge earlier, and he cleaned this up where the wine is at. And as y'all can see, he's in there. Well, y'all can't see, me. but he in there knocked out. But he did do like a lot of cleaning. So what he left me was literally nothing. So that's why I'm trying to get it done because I still want to sweep and mop tonight, y'all. Because it's only 10:19, and I'm looking at like, okay. If I stay up all night doing this, then I won't have to clean nothing when we start moving stuff in. Like, I like to disinfect everything. Call me a germaphobe all day long. I just, I have to disinfect everything. The only thing I have left to do in the living room is I'm going to clean all of these out. Lord, please help me because I ain't got no steps to do. So I might have to get Joseph to clean that one. But I'm going to try my best to clean all these out. And then, y'all, let me tell y'all what else happened. Because I just had a couple of things that, that I just need to update y'all on. Y'all know, stuff be running through my mind as I be cleaning. And then I have stuff to, like, update y'all on as I'm going if I'm not filming. Okay, y'all know earlier in one of these vlogs that me and Joseph went and tried the chicken sandwich from Golden Chick, y'all. When I tell y'all the thing was so far, 10 out of 10, go to Golden Chick and get it. It's the big and wicked chicken sandwich. Please go buy it. Like, please go try it. And y'all, when y'all get it, get the extra zing packets, like the zing seasoning packets. Get like at least two extra on the side because sometimes they put enough, sometimes they don't. But you don't want to go through the drive-thru and you know it be that time where they don't give enough, you know? And you screw. Y'all, oh my Oh my gosh, it is so good. Anyway, I was saying all that to say, Joseph had that earlier this, no, it was like 12, it was like 11 something, 12 o'clock, cause I ended up having Chick-fil-A as y'all saw. Cause I wasn't hungry when we went to go get that for him. Then, I was like, babe, I'm hungry. When we was cleaning earlier, I was like, I kinda want golden chick. And he was like, I'm down. Cause we have been loving that chicken sandwich so much, y'all. I got in the process of cleaning y'all, and I looked up and I saw that it was 10, 11. And so I'm like, dang, what time golden chick closed? In my head, I'm thinking that they closed at 10, but I'm like, you know what, let me see. So I ended up asking Siri what time they closed and they freaking closed at 10. Now it was one that was near us that closed at 10 30 but it was like six miles away and I was like Ugh, I don't want to be that person to show up at 10 20 then y'all give me the last of what y'all got because y'all finna close then I get irritated because my food not fresh so I was just like you know what I'm trying to get my mind off the golden chick but I am hungry y'all so I don't know what I want to get to eat and I kind of don't feel like leaving the house so I don't know but I'm gonna end up waking Joseph up sorry stink butt but <laughs> Right now, I, I kind of got a little distracted dolls on my phone for a little bit, but I'm finna sweep. I'm playing Lotto and her sister doing like a little podcast episode together now. I think Lotto has her own podcast with Apple Music or she like partnered with Apple Music for a podcast. I'm listening to the episode that I ran across on TikTok. So now I'm finna watch it and I'm finna sweep. Yeah, we just finna get into getting too. Good morning, friends. Good morning. From the views, 
okay good morning friends so y'all y'all saw me as i was cleaning up last night i was just mopping i was sweeping literally doing all of that and i ended up going to sleep i ended up let me show y'all so i ended up cleaning up the whole kitchen i cleaned off the counters y'all remember seeing me clean the cabinets like every bit of them y'all i'm surprised my legs ain't so this morning and then i like swept and mopped the floors so yeah swept and mopped the floors in the kitchen the only thing i wanted to get to the bathroom last night but honestly y'all i was so tired and it's crazy because it wasn't even that late i think i went to sleep around like 12 something maybe almost one i was so freaking tired y'all like i was just like i was i was tired i was done but i do need to it's a couple of things that i need to do today me and joseph are about to get ready to head back to the old um place because we need to just finish like literally packing every little thing and we need to take the bed down so that way the movers it'll be easy for them to move the bed and stuff like that because we want them to move the bed first get all the big stuff out the way not the stuff that we can put like in our car and um in a truck yeah that's tea for the morning right now it is seven let me see i think it's 7 41 y'all but anywho who i mean y'all don't care what time it is because y'all seeing this in youtube timing <laughs> oh it's 7 42 so yeah the stove is right so it's 7 40 and the goal is to be leaving here by 8 15 that way we can make it home and get everything we need to get done yeah that's the update and then honestly i don't really know what else we have planned for today so i'm gonna just take y'all like along the day with this of course we have the movers coming but like besides that i don't know what else like it's planned for today so y'all just have to see yeah i'm just chilling y'all i'm just chilling like a villain and to be honest like to say that me and joseph literally slept on the floor last night i didn't wake up with no back pains like my back wasn't hurting nothing like i didn't sleep bad like i i feel like i got some rest you know like this is our little pallet situation y'all but to say we literally slept like back on the flow i didn't feel like no type of way sleeping on the flow so yeah and y'all last night i was watching um tiana taylor she has like this uh interview which i was watching it last vlog if y'all remember i think i showed like a snippet of me watching it but i never got to finish watching like the full thing because i couldn't really pay attention to like what she was saying i was like you know what i'm gonna hear cleaning up let me go ahead and play that y'all didn't interview is so good like when i tell you as i was watching that video like it was just a lot of stuff that she said that i literally resonated with you know like i was telling y'all a few vlogs ago like i literally want to just have like real conversations with myself and um just like pray about it and praying is not just getting on your knees like saying god da, 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 or such and such da, 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 da. it's like literally just having a conversation with yourself like that you talking to god is like you literally sitting with yourself having a conversation that's what i was telling y'all about a few vlogs ago that I wanted to work on instead of running to other people about things that are going on in my life I want to sit down and be able to talk to myself about it and it was just like a lot of stuff she said like you know really not not having no blueprint not having nobody that's like I can take you here and, and give you this and give you that like she was just saying like you know it, every role that she's d done like any creative directing like she's literally worked for that she's fought for that spot that she's in and i feel like that's me youtube in a sense because talk about i got it out the mud like i literally started out with zero subscribers and i've worked my way up to like you know almost well we'll probably be at 1400 by the time this video go up But right now, I'm at like 1397, but that's besides the fact, like just saying like YouTube in general, I haven't got no handout. Nobody has sat down and taught me anything. So, you know, it's just, it's like a proud moment, you know? So I love that interview with her. I actually link it below if you guys want to um, go check it out because I really enjoyed it and I know some other people will enjoy it. I need to put that in my notes to leave that video link down below because sometimes I'll be saying I'm gonna link stuff and don't be linking it. So yeah, but it was really, really good y'all. I ended up watching that when I came and laid down with, well, I was watching it in there and then I finished I don't even know if I finished it last night but I know I was watching it too when I came in here and laid down with Joseph so it was a really dope interview a lot of gems you know just like something about just hearing wise people speak you know like people with a lot of wisdom to share just hearing them speak life into you you know it just it hit different you know it's like sitting up watching a Jay-Z interview that hits different from just like a, a basic rapper you know sitting up watching like a interview of Erica Badu like interviews like that kind of hit different than just watching like somebody with all these chains and just spend their money on materials you know what I'm saying so people like that with interviews kind of hit a little different for me but i'm about to honestly probably straighten up and fold this covering stuff up y'all since we are getting the bed delivered today since joseph is still in the bathroom and then i'll probably just sit y'all up and do like a little montage or i end up talking to y'all later y'all see y'all because yeah I need someone to 
Uh, if I had a thought about it, I would have brought that laundry detergent. Could have put it in there with them, um, whatchamacallit wipes. Luckily, our car is right down there. We ain't got to walk far to go get our car. This is right down there. I just feel like over here, I ain't got to worry about nobody hitting my dough. Like, no badass kids. <laughs> y'all, it is some time later. I know y'all like, okay, hey, girl, we tired of seeing that scarf on your head. I know y'all tired of seeing it, child. I'm tired of having it on here. But I want to update y'all because we have gotten some stuff done. I did not record everything because y'all, babe. When you be moving and get stuff done, last thing you be thinking about, you know, is let me set the camera. As I can see, this is literally everything. So we got the bed stuff, the actual mattress, the headboard. We literally got all the bed stuff out here, boxes, everything, this desk, this TV. I don't know what we gonna do with it because it's not coming with us. I mean, it'll probably come with us, but we're not keeping it is what I mean. Yeah, all this stuff is packed up. Literally empty. Bathroom is empty. I ain't nothing but cleaning products in here. Oh, I need to get that out. I need to get this out. This is what we looking like. Y'all, I had to come in the kitchen because Jokes was trying to break that thing down and my ears are ringing. Tomorrow's probably, we're probably just gonna clean up over here tomorrow, which I'm probably not gonna vlog that. Hey friends, okay, I know y'all haven't seen your girl in a little minute. Well, like a big minute, y'all ain't seen me in a while. So, we literally just got mass majority of everything moved in. We gotta go back to the house and get like, it's like a few more bags that we need to get that has like our shoes in it. Just like a little bit more that we have to go get. But I wanted to get on here and update y'all with everything so far. And also, we were about to close out this vlog because y'all, your girl is tired. I have been moving around all freaking day. I just came from Cane's because I wanted to go get something to eat because I was literally so hungry, y'all. Yeah, um, I've been moving around all day. So I'm about to give me a nap real quick. And then I'm going to get up and I'm going to get some stuff around the house done. And then I'm going to try to get some editing done so I can go and get this video up for tomorrow. But, um, ooh. This is everything that's in so far. So it's just boxes and, and stuff everywhere. Like it's clothes all up here. Um, it's boxes all right there. Boxes right there. Suitcases over there. The only thing that we ended up getting set up was the bed. As y'all can see, Joseph in there. I will definitely see y'all in the next vlog, which is actually going to start tonight. Because y'all know it. we're getting the content out. Your girl is in the bed and I'm finna take the best nap ever. Like I'm literally finna take the best nap ever. I don't even want to set an alarm, but I am. I love you so much. I appreciate you so much much and y'all already know until the next vloggy the big one she's out the mother cut i'm out the mother freaking cut